Hi, so I'm going to be reviewing the My Baby MB 100 Plus Travel System. This is the grey and white stars that we've got. Uh, we've been using this for around three months now and um, so far we love it. This is the seat unit to be used from six months plus. Um, the hood can be flat or it can actually come down right onto the handle for when it's sunny and bright and you don't want the sun in your baby's eyes um, which is handy. It's also got a viewfinder on the top so you can see baby clearly in there and there's also a pocket at the back for keys, purse, phone, anything like that which is handy. Um, so the seat unit can be completely laid flat so it can actually be used from birth um, and there's different levels you can have the seat so you can have baby set up or completely laid flat or anywhere in between. Um, the basket on the underneath is really accessible. It's a really good sized basket and you can fit quite a lot under there. Um, yes, yeah, so this is the unit. We've not actually used this bit yet as our baby is only three months old. Um, but it looks comfy and looking forward to using this. So I'm now going to show you what um, the carry cot looks like that we are currently using with our baby. So to take this seat unit off, there is just two straps underneath, one at the front and one at the back that just velcro together. So you just undo those velcro straps. Um, and then on the sides here, there is two clips on each side that this unit clips onto. So you just unclip them both to each side. This comes completely off. And then if you lift the leg part up, um, there's two plastic sections that this actually just um, slides onto so you just literally so you just take these off which you just unclip at the bottom and the seat unit just completely comes off like that and for the handle there is two buttons underneath that you just press and it just lifts off like that so to use the carry cot now with the frame, um, there are two circular buttons at the side and they just pull out like that. And then this is the carry cot. It's really lightweight. I can carry this with just one hand. It's not heavy at all. Um, so this basically using these clips on the side, they just clip onto the plastic bits you just pull it out. line them up and then just simply click on like that and then you're ready to go. So this carry cot section we are currently using this at the minute um, it's really good size um, baby fits in this perfect and still loads of room yet even when our baby's three months old. Um, really comfy um, you get the the cover which is just velcro so you just velcro these on there's four velcro parts like this and there's also a little pocket so you can attach it to the hood so this doesn't come away when it's windy or anything like that the hood to get down there's just two large buttons at the side you press them both in and this is completely flat you can also move it to different heights like this and because of the button, the wind won't push it down because you have to actually use the button to get that down. The only problem using this carry cart is you can't really access the basket underneath as it just completely covers it. But they have included, if you can see, um, a flap at the front of the basket, um, which you can access in there, but you can't really get large items in or out because it's not a huge flap. Um, that's the only problem really with using the carry cot um, but we've not found it a major, a major problem to be honest 
but there is a flap there to get things in and out so they have thought about that um, so this is the Kerry cap so now I'm going to show you how to get your car seat onto the pram so again to get this off there's just where this handle is there's just two buttons one at each side press the buttons and it just easily lifts off like that so for the car seat again the car seats in the matching pattern you get your two adapters to fit onto the pram and obviously your car seat so the adaptives have an L and an R on so you know which side goes onto which so these again just use the clips at the bottom here to clip onto the plastic parts that you just pulled out before to put the carry cut on so left so these just simply clip on like that and then the car seat where these handle is there's like a clip underneath these are what clips onto the adapters so again just simply line it up and that simply clicks into place and off you go with your car seat so that's really handy when you're out and about in the car if you're just nipping in and out of shops just to simply click that on um if you're not going to be out for very long obviously and again with this just the basket underneath it's really accessible and it's a great size we use put our um changing bag under there when we're using this car seat obviously it doesn't fit with the carry cart but with this it fits perfect um it's been really good it's got good padding on the strap so it's really comfortable it's got the added newborn support in there which we're still using as he fits in there still perfectly fine but there's still loads of room so it will last us for a good while probably until there's at least one who will last in this and again really like to carry um fits in the car really well it's not an iso fixed base but um that didn't matter to us anyway because our car is not an ISO fix base anyway so it just literally straps in with the car seat like the normal way. Um, so the only other thing to mention is um, the handle can't be adjusted so if you're quite tall or short I would suggest trying this out first before you get it because for us it's perfect I'm around 5 foot 6 I think. Um, and it's perfect for me it's perfect for my husband family members that have used it it's perfect for them but as i say if you are tall or a bit quite short then i would suggest maybe trying this out first before you go and buy it as you can't adjust the handle um that's the only problem really that's about pram the only fault i can really find other than that we absolutely love the pram um it's really nice to push when you're out really smooth um, great swivel wheels at the front which is so easily pushed around and you know moving around um, the pram also comes with um, a rain cover but this rain cover is only for the main seat unit that I showed you first um, but they also they do do a spare one for um, the carry cart and it also fits the car seat that's £10 I think on the website which I got it's, it fits them both perfect so I mean for £10 it's not too bad um, so that's another thing to remember if you get this you will need a separate rain cover if you know the weather's bad and you're using the carry cot or the car seat but it does come with um, the rain cover for the seat unit um, so I'll show you now how you fold this pram down. Um, so again, to get this off the car seat underneath, um, there are red buttons. So you just simply press the red buttons on the car seat and it just simply lifts out. And to fold this, you also need to take the adapters off. So again, it's just two buttons here. You just lift it up and they just simply come out like that. So to fold this unit down, it will fold down with the main seat unit that I showed you in the beginning. It will fold down with that on it, but it won't fold down with the carry cot or the car seat. So you will need to take those off when you want to fold it down. So to fold it down, um, here on the handle there's a little button to push in and a large button to push up. So you've got to push it in and then push up. 
and then it just simply pushes forward and down until you hear it click like that and then that's now clipped together so again it's really light I can simply lift this up easy enough in and out of the car um, I have a Citroen C3 and this fits fine in the boot I do have to take one of the back wheels off um, but it fits perfect once I took one of the wheels off it was just slightly too big but if you have a decent sized car it will fit in your boot no problem um, so to take a wheel off just in case you wanted to know underneath there is just a little lever so you just pull it and the wheel just simply comes off and again to put it back on pull out the lever and the wheel will just simply flip back on like that so to get the the frame back up once it's you get it back out of the car on this side there is a little lever which which is clipped on now to keep it folded up so you just pull out the lever and it will simply pull back up until you hear it click again and you're ready to go so that is it it's really light really simple to use it looks really nice there isn't a huge amount of colours there's the one we have, the grey and white stars. I think they also do um, a pink, a blue, black and a cream. I think they're the colours that they have. It's not a huge range of colours, but there is you know, a decent choice. But we got this as we, wasn't, we didn't know the gender of our baby until he was born. So we just got this because we thought it was obviously quite neutral. Um, so I hope this helps anyone who's thinking of getting this travel system. I would really recommend getting it. As I said, the only problem is the handle that can't be adjusted. I think the handle height is 102 centimetres, I think, when I looked on the website, so just over a metre. So you might be able to gauge that, working that out, if, like I said, if you are tall or quite short, whether that would suit you. Um, this travel system was £269.99 I think, so just under £270, which for a travel system with everything included I think is a great price. Um, it's really suited us, so I would really recommend this if you are thinking of getting it um, and I hope this has helped anyone who was wondering what the travel system is like. So thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye!